Before we start this video, please make sure that you subscribe to our channel if you haven't already, and turn on the notification bell so you won't miss our new videos. Turtle, tortoise, and terrapin are all names for the hard-shelled, egg-laying reptiles in the taxonomic order Chelonia. Basically, they're all turtles. These magnificent creatures come in all shapes and sizes and live in a number of different environments. With more than 300 species of turtle in the world, here are the 10 most beautiful turtles in the world. Number 10. Native to the southern United States and northern Mexico, the red-eared sliders are often found in slow-moving streams, creeks, lakes, ponds, and marshes with a fresh and warm water supply. The red-eared sliders are strong swimmers and will spend a majority of their time in the water. They bask a lot too, and during warm sunny days, wild red ears love to stack on top of each other while doing so. The slightest movement or sound will send them sliding off their rocks or logs and back into the water. This, coupled with the red ear mark on both sides of their heads, gives them their common name. The red-eared slider has a long history in the pet trade and it has been kept for many years by a wide variety of hobbyists, both beginners and veterans. Being one of the most common turtles found for sale in pet stores across the U.S. and overseas, this turtle is available in various types of morphs as they are being bred in captivity. Number 9. The yellow-bellied slider is a subspecies of the pond turtle and is native to parts of the U.S. It is the most common turtle in its range and is very much popular as an aquarium pet. Yellow-bellied sliders are often confused with the red-eared sliders, which have red or orange stripes down the sides of their heads, unlike the former, since they both have features in common, as also, share their natural range. The shell of this turtle has a typically brown and black coloration, often bearing bright yellow stripes, while the skin has an olive green color with distinct yellow patches down the legs and neck region. Yellow-bellied sliders mostly prefer still water bodies, like ponds, and are found in slow-moving rivers, marshes, floodplain swamps, and frequently colonizes seasonal wetlands like Carolina Bays. Number 8. Only found in the Pearl River system in Mississippi and Louisiana, the ringed map turtles prefer wide rivers with either a clay or sandy bottom that have moderate to strong currents. They require areas with abundant basking sites formed by debris and fallen trees. Males and females of the ringed map turtles have dark olive shells with some yellow and orange spots on the scutes scales. The scutes around the edge have yellow semicircle patterns and the underbelly is yellow while the skin on the head and body is blackish with yellow stripes. There is a large yellow stripe on top of the head that runs from the tip of the snout to behind the eyes, whereas the legs have one or two stripes that run along their length. Ringed map turtles are listed as vulnerable on the IUCN Red List as they are thought to be threatened by pollution, habitat destruction in their aquatic habitats, and the risk of very destructive hurricanes. Capture for the pet trade is also placing this species at risk. Number 7. Only occurring naturally in the extreme southern and southwestern part of the island of Madagascar, the radiated tortoise can grow to a shell length of up to 16 inches, 41 centimeters, and weighing up to 35 pounds, 16 kilograms. It has the basic tortoise body shape, which consists of the high domed shell, a blunt head and elephantine feet. The carapace, upper shell, of the radiated tortoise is brilliantly marked with yellow lines radiating from the center of each dark plate of the shell, hence the name radiated tortoise. This star pattern is more finely detailed and intricate than the normal pattern of other star pattern tortoise species, such as the Indian star tortoise. With the lifespan of up to 50 years, this tortoise feeds during the day primarily on grasses, fruit, and succulent plants. They are known to graze regularly in the same area, thus keeping the vegetation in that area closely trimmed. Number 6. Also known as the ornate or painted wood turtle, the Central American wood turtle is found in wild habitats from northern Costa Rica to southern Nicaragua. Being a smart, sociable, and well-tempered turtle, 
This species is a popular and common wood turtle within the pet trade. The Central American wood turtle is known for coming in a variety of colors. Individuals that are from Costa Rica will showcase bright colors, while the ones from Nicaragua will be more subdued. Some of these turtles will really stand out with yellow and orange swirls and different degrees of black eye spots on their carapace. Along with a varied diet of leafy greens, protein, fruits and vegetables, they require additional calcium to ensure healthy shell growth. Unlike aquatic turtles, the Central American wood turtles don't require water in order to swallow their food. Number 5. The Diamondback Terrapin, or simply Terrapin, is a species of turtle native to the brackish coastal tidal marshes of the eastern and southern United States and in Bermuda. The carapace of the Diamondback Terrapin varies in color from brownish or greenish to grayish or nearly black. Their scaly gray or whitish skin is covered with black spots or streaks. The carapace is covered with scutes that have diamond-shaped concentric growth rings inside, where the growth rings may be a different color than the rest of the shell. Terrapins look much like their freshwater relatives, but are well adapted to the nearshore marine environment. They have several adaptations that allow them to survive in varying salinities, where they can live in full-strength saltwater for extended periods of time, and their skin is largely impenetrable to salt. Terrapins also exhibit unusual and sophisticated behavior to obtain fresh water, including drinking the freshwater surface layer that can accumulate on top of salt water during rainfall and raising their heads into the air with mouths open to catch falling raindrops. Number four. Found in India, Sri Lanka, and Pakistan, the Indian star tortoise inhabits dry and arid forests, scrublands, and grasslands. It has dark brown or black carapace with beige and yellow star-shaped markings, which provide camouflage, while the plastron, belly shell, is black-colored with yellow stripes. The shape of this creature is presumed to be specially adapted to naturally assist it to return to a stable stance after it has been turned over. During dry, hot weather, Indian star tortoises are mostly active during the early morning and late afternoon. The rest of the day, these tortoises shelter under vegetation or other cover. During the rainy season, however, their activity level increases tremendously and they can be observed moving around and feeding during much of the day. Being a popular species in the exotic pet trade, the Indian star tortoise is now considered as endangered. Number 3. The yellow blotched map turtle is a medium-sized turtle that inhabits river sections with moderate current sand and clay bottom with many sandbars or rocky bottom with limestone ledges along banks. The carapace is olive to light brown with conspicuous black shiny projections on keel, top of the shell. Each coastal scoot has an irregular bright yellow or orange blotch. Meanwhile, the plastron is cream colored with a black pattern along scoot seams. Yellow blotched map turtles, like all the other map turtles, bask to warm themselves. It spends much of the day basking on these fallen trees and quickly jumps into the water when approached. It is very difficult to approach them. Females may bite when handled, but males and juveniles remain calm and withdraw into their shells. Number 2. Found in the Kalahari Desert and Cape Province of South Africa, the geometric tortoise is one of the rarest tortoise species in the world. The convex-shaped shell of the geometric tortoise has a bright yellow starred pattern on a black background and a similar but duller, less defined pattern on the underside. It is superficially very similar to the more common and widespread tent tortoise, but differs from it in that, in the geometric tortoise, the marginal shields are higher than they are wide, and there are no buttock tubercles on the back of the hind legs. The front legs are covered with unequal sized scales and the front feet have five toes. With only 2,000 to 3,000 individuals existing today, this tortoise is threatened for a number of reasons, including loss of habitat. Its eggs are a source of food for the African people and traders capture the adults for their shells, which are used to make decorative items. Number 1. The Green Sea Turtle, also known as the Green Turtle, extends throughout tropical and subtropical areas around the world, 
with two distinct populations in the Atlantic and Pacific Oceans, but it is also found in the Indian Ocean. The common name refers to the usually green fat found beneath its carapace, not to the color of its carapace, which can include shades of different colors, including dark brown, green, olive, yellow, and black. Green sea turtles are considered endangered by the IUCN and face a multitude of threats, including habitat loss, harvesting of their eggs, damage to nesting beaches and entanglement in fishing gear. They are one of the largest sea turtle species, but interestingly, are also the only one that's completely herbivorous. Albinism within this species occurs, but most of the new albino hatchlings don't survive too long as their unusual coloring makes them especially vulnerable to predators. However, if they do survive into adulthood, the albino sea turtles are a sight to behold. They are truly one beautiful, majestic creature.